What's up guys? This is Andrea from A Doctor in the House and I just wanted to make a vlog today. Uh, it's Friday. I'm on my radiology rotation which is a required rotation during fourth year at IU School of Medicine. That's where I go. And um, I had a midterm this morning. I had a test and then I had an awesome day. I went shopping and just kind of hung out. Everything is great. Um, but I wanted to make a vlog today. I've been getting a ton of emails and questions about how to schedule your day and how to plan out your time and kind of how to fit everything in um, if you're a pre-med or if you're in med school. So um, people asking me how I plan out my day, I thought I'd do a vlog and tell you. Uh, but first, I want to talk about these sweet scrubs that I'm wearing. Um, these are figs scrubs, if you can see the little insignia, figs. Um, it's an awesome company that makes scrubs, and for every pair of scrubs that you buy, they give a pair of scrubs to a physician in an area of need. And so it's a really good cause. Um, you can buy them on figscrubs.com. And uh, in med school, we generally get scrubs from the hospital. They're hospital-issued scrubs. But during first year and second year, I needed scrubs for anatomy lab and pathology, histology. We wore scrubs. And I think I just bought scrubs at Walmart. I had no idea where to get scrubs. And if I would known about this awesome company, I totally would have bought them earlier. But they're super soft. They're great. Here, I'll do a little stand up and twirl. Here are my fig scrubs. And I got a pair of navy blue because I always wear light blue at the hospital. I thought I would do something different. So anyways, buy some fig scrubs if you're uh, in the market for some scrubs. All right, so on to how I plan my day. Um, so I started doing this in college when I had a million things I had to fit in during my day and I had a million things to study and um, I just had to make it all work. You, in college, you're the most involved and the busiest you'll ever be and so you have to figure out a way to fit it all in. So I would always plan out my day hourly. Um, I would do it either in my planner, I live by my planner, uh, especially in college, um, or I would do it on a piece of paper. So either the night before um, or the morning of that day, I would just make a list of things I need to do that day and what's scheduled for that day. So for example, if I had class from 8 to 9 and then from 9 to 10 I had a break and I would write in what I was doing during that break. So studying biology or uh, going to this meeting or working out, whatever. Just schedule everything in as far as your day goes. And then as far as study time, I schedule that too. So let's say um, I'm kind of done with all the things required during my day by 6 p.m. So I've um, gone to all my classes, I've gone to all the meetings that I have, I've done everything I need to do, I've worked out, and everything's done by 6 p.m. So from 6 to 9, 6 to 10, 6 to 11, that's my study time. And that's how this would go in college. And so I would plan that out on a piece of paper or on the on the whiteboard. I wish you could see my whiteboard. Can you see? Hold on. Can you see it there? I was studying radiology this morning. You see my whiteboard? I, I love studying with a whiteboard. And if you don't, you should watch my video called How to Study. Um, and I talk about, I talk all about how I study with whiteboards. So anyways, um, on a piece of paper on the whiteboard, schedule out your whole studying time. So I would do, say like 6 p.m., we're going to study biology, chapter 4 or something. So that's at 6. Then at 7, we're going to do chapter 5. 